Arts Festival is a fantastic event for Brisbane, for Australia, and so Arab wanted to be heavily involved and a major key partner in innovation and foresight to make sure that this festival could be the greatest thing that it can be. So this evening we've had a, a wonderful uh, client event here where we've been running a panel discussion on subtropical and tropical cities. We're here outside, it feels subtropical, it's slightly humid, and the city's a kind of sparkling backdrop. One, one of the challenges is to, is to kind of create a consensus of change. It's interesting the relationship between how cities, I think, are able to change because for a city to change, a city is a kind of a, is, is an amalgam of us. Therefore, we have to take a collective decision. We're here to shape a better world. We take that incredibly seriously and it's a huge platform to create energy and enthusiasm. We're incredibly privileged to be the ongoing foresight and innovation sponsor for the World Science Festival. As part of World Science Festival 2018, ARAP is hosting two workshops on the circular economy. We've had academics, we've had people from government and we've had people from the private sector all collaborating together to discuss the principles of the circular economy and how it's applicable to Queensland. I'm so happy that ARAP has put on this workshop today. It's brought a lot of really exciting people together to talk about the circular economy and it's so key to have all these different perspectives to actually work on systems change. down at Street Science as part of the World Science Festival. So we're working um, with children around the engineering design process. So today they're being engineers for the day. I was an engineer today. We've got lots of children getting in and doing some planning and building and designing for things that Brisbane needs in 2030. I was gonna make a wind turbine that can spin on sun and wind. There's been some really great reactions from parents and their kids. In particular, I think some parents don't understand just how innovative their kids can be. I was at Angelia today. I think the value to ARAC in this is encouraging our future generations to actually think about engineering as a, as a career. So you see a lot of staff and a lot of clients with their kids here, so it's really lovely to see them mucking in with the sticky tape and straws and helping their kids out as well. My daddy's an engineer. When I grow up, I want to be one too.